launch phase of the kick in that last step towards the ball you want your whole upper body your chin and your head over the ball that will give you a nice strong position over the ball uh, your plant foot you want next to the ball ideally and then your driving leg will be having a look at the power leg or the kicking leg the role of, of, of the leg as well um, important to, to, to focus on the plant foot where it ends up and then all, obviously also the power that you generate to pull your body towards your target so let's, let's look, look at uh, Richie Mohanga an example three at half time. Richie Mwonga just before half time and he does land the extra three so Richie Mwonga really attacks this ball in, uh, it's a power step into the ball he gets his plant foot right next to the ball um, you can see his whole upper, upper body, his chin, thorax, pelvis over the ball. Um, his hips is pointing towards the yellow arrows currently. So he wants the power leg to pull him towards the target, which is the red arrow. You'll see in the next picture now coming up, there the power leg pulls his hips and his upper body towards his target. And that's where the ball will go as well. Let's take a look. You can see Richie here not attacking this ball as aggressively in that last launch step, actually planting his plant foot behind the ball. Uh, by doing so, you can see his upper body is not over the ball and as strong as in the first example. So by doing this, it actually opens up his hips uh, and once his drive and kicking leg comes through, the ball will fade to the left. If you could have this kick over, ideally, that's where Richie wanted to have been right next to the ball and then the power leg can just pull him towards the target so just two nice pointers your plant foot and then aggressively attacking this ball to generate some power in the extension of your knee coming through the ball and once you drive through the ball this will actually pull your whole body towards your target and and where your body goes there the ball will ultimately end up as well so i hope you can you can use that in your next kicking session with your with your players Here's a nice ex example of, of a session that I use, uh, just planting the agility poles that, that can give a, a marker for the player to work through, focusing on the plant foot and then also um, attacking this ball and driving through the ball, so really being aggressive and kicking to the side of the poles.